First thing I picked up was this beautiful day perfume sample from Bath and Body Works. They sent out a an offer on Facebook for a free sample of this. This is like a quarter ounce. It's a pretty good size. And this scent is perfect for spring. It's very bright and pretty. It's floral mixed with citrus, a little bit of apple. Um, like I said, very bright. I like it a lot and it's probably going to be one of my favorite scents besides Paris Amour. So that was free. I also had in the mail two sets of the spring coupons which were 20% off your entire purchase and a free hand sanitizer. They sent one to me and one to my husband. So I used them both, of course. So the two free hand sanitizers, I got two fresh picked um, tangerine hand sanitizers because we just love citrus of any sort. So those are going to be nice. And for the first 20% off purchase that I did, I got this lavender vanilla room spray. These things are aerosol cans. They last forever. This is for my son's room, so I don't have to have candles or a Scentsy warmer or anything like that in there. But this will just keep it nice and fresh. These are $5, and so with 20% off, I got, got it for $4. And because I bought it during the spring fresh market event, they do these events every once in a while where they bring out new things, and if you buy a certain thing or a certain type of thing, then you get something for free. So when I bought that, I got this free market peach candle. It came in a little bag, but the bag isn't that special. But this is a $10 candle, one of the small jars and it smells good. It's peach. It's a relaunch. They've had it before, but it is nice and fresh, and I will enjoy it. So that was a nice perk for buying something for $4. And then yesterday, I went back and picked up some candles while they were still two for 22. They used to do them two for 20, and I guess they figured people would still buy them for this price, which is true. But I actually got the two of these for about $4 total out of pocket because I had a merchandise credit that I had been forgetting to use for like six months and I finally remembered and I had that second 20% off coupon so they came out to about four bucks after all my discounts and all that but I got this lemon mint leaf and it's a green color and it's pretty lemony I don't smell a lot of mint maybe the mint will come out when I burn it but I think it's gonna be nice and fresh and I got pineapple orchid which they've had for a few years I don't know if they put it out last year, but they did have it for several years because this is one of few candles that my husband's ever commented on and said that he really enjoyed it. It's very sweet, and I just kind of think that when your husband says, hey, I really like this, that's like permission to buy it. So I bought that because he cannot complain about that. So that's a good deal for um, $8 at Bath & Body Works out of pocket. I got two large candles, a small candle, a room spray, two hand sanitizers, and a perfume sample. So get on Facebook and be a Facebook fan because you never know what they're going to send you. And make sure you sign up when they ask you for your email address or your phone number so they can send you coupons and you can get good deals like this. I also ordered... Um, a perfume, and I don't wear a lot of perfume at all, actually. Lately, I've been on a perfume spree, which is really weird because I'm not a big perfume fan. Usually, even if it's a pretty calm scent or very light or I don't apply a lot, it sets off my allergies. But lately, I've been loving them, and I ordered from Avon Haiku. This is one of my favorite perfumes from them, one of very few perfumes that I like from them, actually. They have a very fast turnover. But this one's been around for a while. It's very fresh. It's um, not really an oriental scent. It's kind of more like a musky, soft, springy, borderline masculine scent. My husband smelled it and thought that it might be for him. He wasn't for sure. But I like it a lot. I don't have the notes on it in front of me. I will find them and hopefully put them in the drop-down bar. But it's really nice. It was on sale for $10, and I'm enjoying it so far. At CVS, I picked up this Rimmel Stay Matte Powder. Um, they've changed the packaging. My last one was like a black base. And I accidentally got Sandstorm instead of Translucent, but it seems to match. I mean, I just use a light dusting on, of it on occasion, so it shouldn't be a big deal. But it was on sale, and I had a coupon, an extra buck, so I got it for like $4 instead of 7 or something. I also went to Trader Joe's and picked up some of my favorite tea tree oil soap. 
I actually used up one of these in January. I don't think I even remembered to put it in the video. Um, but it's got two bars here of four ounces each. And this has just got tea tree oil. It's very cleansing. And these are $2 for two bars. So it's a pretty good deal. We use it all over our bodies. And I picked up their tea tree oil as well, which was $6.49 or $6.99, a pretty decent price for one ounce of this. And we just kind of like dab this on problem areas on our skin, on our face as we need it. It says don't use it um, full strength on your face, but really if you just like dip your fingertip in it and put it on, it doesn't really cause us any irritations and we both have pretty sensitive skin so we do use a lot of tea tree oil and um, I was excited to get it at that price because I think the, mo the least I've paid for tea tree oil so far has been more like nine dollars so that was a good find and then I also went to the flea market not flea market farmers market the flea markets really far away and I don't know why they call it a flea market um, but I picked up this soy tart in lavender from a lady from another town who handcrafts them and I'm kind of disappointed it was $6.50 and it's got six bars here I could put it in my Scentsy warmer it's lavender scented and she had a corresponding candle that I could smell and the candle smelled really nice like lavender I got this home put a tart in my Scentsy warmer and within five minutes I was having a massive headache it does not smell like lavender it smells like old lady house and not like classy clean old lady house like mothball it's really really bad and don't think she does refunds <laughs> but I don't it's just not a scent for me it does not smell remotely like lavender it changes in the warmer and I'm very unhappy with it I really feel like I've wasted 650 and I'm annoyed I don't know what to do but maybe somebody I know will want this for whatever reason so I guess I'm gonna see if I can pawn it off on somebody because I don't like it it doesn't really smell like mothballs it just doesn't smell fresh it doesn't smell like lavender it's not something that I enjoy and it gives me a headache so hopefully I'll find somebody who thinks it smells super awesome and I can give it to them but that's all I have for you today make sure to stay subscribed so that you can catch our newest videos we'll have empties and what else do we do favorites and fails every month. So make sure you stay tuned and we'll see you later. Bye.